Born around 1130 in Verdun, Nicolas was drawn to the arts at a young age. His French roots deeply influenced his early works. As a goldsmith, his innate talents began to mold under Romanesque traditions, etching a path toward mastery. Nicolas's technique was revolutionary. He excelled in cloisonné enamel work, creating intricate designs that told religious stories. One of his earliest notable achievements was the Altar of Klosterneuburg, which astonished viewers with its detailed narrative and vibrant colors. Around 1200, he embarked on his most ambitious project, the Verdun Altar. This piece showcased his unparalleled skills in both enamel and goldsmithing. Its panels depicted biblical scenes with unprecedented detail and became a benchmark for Romanesque art. Known for his humility, yet esteemed by peers, Nicholas contributed significantly to ecclesiastic art. His works reflected deep piety and a robust understanding of biblical themes, reinforcing Romanesque ideals while pushing artistic boundaries. Nicholas passed away around 1230, but his legacy lived on. His techniques and craftsmanship influenced generations of artists, cementing him as a pivotal figure in medieval art. His masterpieces are still studied for their innovation and devotion. Through Nicholas's life, one lesson stands clear. Dedication to one's craft can bridge the divine and the mortal. His art not only adorned churches, but also touched the hearts of many, leaving an indelible mark on the history of art.